Together we are going to draw the Venn diagram of A complement intersect B. Now just before we get started, I'm gonna draw you a generic two section Venn diagram. Here's section A, here's section B. And this outer bit is meant to be stuff that's not A or B. Some teachers call that S for sample space. Others call it U for the universe. Whichever way your teacher does it is probably the way you should do it. But how do you do this one here? A complement intersect B. Well, A complement is math code for stuff that is not inside of the circle A. And intersect is math for and meaning that both of these have to be true for you to shade that section of the Venn diagram. B is short for B, which means that if you're going to shade something, it has to be inside of B as well. Well, especially when you have the word and here. So what we're looking to do on this diagram is shade in areas that are not in A, and also they have to be inside B as well. So this section and this section here are not allowed to be shaded because we require the shading to not B and A. So the only options we have are this outer portion and this portion of B. But we also require it to be inside of B as well. So the only area we get to shade is this. There's your Venn diagram. It is inside of B and not inside of A. There you go. You're welcome. Hopefully this gives you the confidence to build your own Venn diagram. Best of luck.